Thanks for staying with us. Government aims to have the Bahamas removed from the European Union's list of non-compliant jurisdictions by October. Attorney General and Minister of Legal Affairs Senator the Honorable Ryan Pinder says the EU is scheduled to reevaluate the country's substance reporting regime to ensure it meets international best practices. He says the legislation has been addressed. Being on the EU non-cooperative list has to do with the economic substance regime of the Bahamas. And, and there were really three um, aspects on why we were on the non-cooperative list. Uh, the first one would be the, um, the legislation um, and updating the legislation to make sure we were compliant with international best practices. The second component was uh, the reporting portal. Um, was ineffective that was in place. That was the one that was put in place through inland revenue. And the third component was we needed to show that we were actually enforcing the laws, doing on-site inspections, seeing if everybody was complying, who should be complying. Opinder well, says government passed the Commercial Entities Substance Requirement Act, or CESRA, during Parliament's last session, while government engaged BDO chartered accountants to construct a purpose-built economic substance portal. There is a training session launching this week with industry to, um, to train on the usage and to get some feedback. And we're looking at a full launch of that portal uh, first week in September, um, just in time to the, for the end of the reporting period, which ends September 30th. Uh, on the enforcement side, um, the Ministry of Finance, who's the competent authority, have been doing on-site inspections. They've done in excess of 30 on-site inspections um, to evaluate compliance with reporting. They found a few that were non-compliant. They've actually issued fines. Um, and ask for remediation on those aspects. So those on-site inspections are, are underway, um, and they have about 35 more slated uh, to start in September. So, so we're meeting all the expectations that were laid out for us.